Hi there, this is Irene from Adroit Architecture. Welcome to our channel. If you're new here, Karibu Sana, where have you been? If you're a regular, we appreciate you. Thanks for watching this video. Today, we have a very exciting video for you. Very highly requested and an extremely popular design currently. We bring to you the Love Nest A-Frame Cottage. When you think about the A-Frame home, you instantly think about a romantic getaway, a honeymoon cottage deep in the woods. If you are looking to enter into the Airbnb space, you cannot go wrong with an A-Frame cottage. It is small enough not to be intimidating to construct and very popular in the market. Let's take a look at a few key features of the Lovenest A-Frame cottage. We have given our A-Frame cottage short walls, with the roof coming very low but not touching the ground. The huge advantage of this is that you get a right angular living space. This eliminates the awkward angles that come with the A-frame design that make furniture organization very tricky and can lead to a lot of wasted spaces. A nifty corner fireplace. This fireplace is unique and can be used both from the inside of the house and from the outside patio of the house. A usable loft. This is a space that can be customized to fit the needs of each client. So go ahead and let us know what you would like us to do with this space. Let's take a look at the floor plan. From the paved walkway, enter through the doors into the cozy lounge. Located at the corner of the lounge, you have a fireplace. This is the nifty fireplace I was talking about that serves both the lounge as well as the patio outside. Double doors lead from the lounge into the patio where you have a nice sitting area and of course the fireplace. At the patio, you can sit and relax, enjoying the views around you. You can catch the sunset or the sunrise, enjoying a good cup of coffee in the evening or in the morning. The lounge and the kitchen are seated side by side in an open plan setup. Between the lounge and the kitchen, you have your dining area, perfectly sized for intimate meals. The kitchen is modest in size but perfect for your guests. At the corner of the kitchen, you have a pantry cabinet providing additional storage space. Right after the kitchen, we have utilized the corner space to set up a laundry area as well as additional storage space. A-frame cottages tend to be small in size. Small spaces need to have a lot of storage space that is niftily incorporated into the design. A door leads from the kitchen area onto the side walkway. You have a modest master bedroom with its own private bathroom. You also have another bedroom that is big enough for two occupants. This can be used as a bedroom when you have many guests. It can also be used as an office or a chill out area when you're only entertaining a couple. You have a separate full bathroom that serves the second bedroom as well as any other guests in the house. As earlier stated, you have enough space in the roof to create a loft. The loft space can be customized as the client sees fit. We can provide a permanent staircase or a movable ladder to serve the loft. The Lovenest A-Frame Cottage has a total of 68 square meters without including the loft space. You can comfortably build this A-frame home in a 40 by 60 piece of land. That is 12 meters by 18 meters. You will have a decent amount of space to create your outdoor spaces. The estimated cost of construction for this A-frame cottage is approximately 2.5 million. We use the construction cost handbook to estimate the cost of construction. This is a handbook that is provided and updated every year by the Institute of Quantity Surveyors of Kenya. 
Keep in mind that if you will be using this design for an Airbnb cottage, you do want to ensure that the finishes are great, meeting the expectations of your guests. And that is the Love Nest A-Frame Cottage, featuring two bedrooms, two bathrooms, an indoor-outdoor fireplace, and a customizable loft space. Do you have any question concerning this house plan or any other house plan? Leave them in the comment section below. Do you need to contact us? We have provided our contact information in the description box. Get in touch with us anytime. If you haven't subscribed, Remember to hit that subscribe button, it's absolutely free. Turn on your notifications so that you will know when we have a new video up. Thank you for watching this video. I'll see you in our next video.